Well, greetings to you wherever in the world you are and uh, whatever time you might be seeing this video. thought it might be easier than rather than doing a lot of typing, just take a few minutes to send you a video and update you on where things are at. As you can see, I'm not at home. Uh, I'm at my sister's place in Outram, which is just like south of Dunedin, along with my with Julie and Francesca and my younger sister Serena, who's down from Auckland. Um, the current situation with mum is, uh, things are not great with mum. Um, there is a combination of some chronic lung, some heart failure, now some kidney failure, uh, re renal failure, some liver dysfunction, and that couple, that couple with some diabetes issues. Yay, Brilliant's just doing a dance in front of me. Yay. I score you 9 out of 10. <laughs> the earth is moving here in Dunedin. Mightn't have just been thunder and lightning today. <coughs> oh, look. <coughs> so all of those things um, also connected with some TIA stuff, which is transient ischematic um, attacks, which a little bit many strokes means that... <laughs> <laughs> my sister's doing forward rolls as I'm recording this. Um, what a fantastic time we've had today. Um, I spent some really neat time with mum last night just um, sharing that time with her, holding her hand, talking about a bunch of things. <clears throat> Went out to the um, a couple of cemeteries and looked to choose a, a plot for mum to be buried in and spent a couple of hours at the funeral directors yesterday. And I was able to talk to mum about those things last night, and she was okay about talking about those things. Did have an opportunity to tuck her into bed, basically, and to pray with her. And I did pray for her for peace um, in the last days, in the last hours of her life. And her response was, not quite yet, um, which obviously indicates that that's on her mind. <coughs> uh, she also has a couple of other infections going on in her body, which... Of course, your body is going to take quite something to respond to. <clears throat> so what does that mean from here on in? Uh, the long and the short is it means that mum's condition is not going to improve. Um, over, it, it's simply going to decline. So whether that's going to um, be in the next couple of days or whether it's going to be in the next week, um, you know, she's really in the hands of the Lord in terms of that. Um, we've been planning also for mum's funeral and have talked to mum about that we're going to have a night with Colleen and have quite a traditional wake out at the Outram uh, Church Hall in which we will um, sing some songs, do some items have some reading, have some prayers have an opportunity for people to perform items to broadcast uh, to at least project some videos and some of those sorts of things as a way of honouring mum and uh, have an opportunity to have some drink and some food with her as well. And then uh, an opportunity for a Mariah Stice sleepover. Um, I'm going to, and there might be a small number of people uh, who, are, who are interested in doing that one. And then we'll bring mum uh, in our car out to um, uh, the cemetery to be buried. And so, <clears throat> in some ways, uh, sure. I guess it's been a difficult time, but um, it's been a neat time to um, share these things with mum and to have the opportunity to um, celebrate her life now, for us all to spend time with mum and to uh, plan these things as well as a, a great way of honouring mum and giving thanks for her life as well. <coughs> We had a variety show this afternoon. We turned up and we were dressed in wigs and songs and completely impromptu. Had a prompt, impromptu concert for about 30 minutes. Uh, Mum was perhaps a little bit embarrassed to start with, uh, but going to be sharing some of those videos and some of those photos shortly. Some of you may have already seen some of those ones already on the website. So thank you to those of you being sending messages of prayer and of support and of love and thinking about Mum and about the rest of the family, myself and the members of my family at this time. We still do appreciate that and um, ask you to continue to do so. 
and for mum as well. So, uh, Kaikite Ano, and God bless you all. Uh, thank you, and I'll give you another update soon. Bye for now.